Hi, we're at the Food Labs conference here in Chicago, and we're meeting with Steve Kuchenberg from EMD Millipore. There's been a lot of conversation, Steve, about air monitoring and environmental monitoring in food labs, and I know you guys are one of the leaders in providing solutions. And today you presented a couple of great ideas, and what I'd like you to do is focus in a little bit about what EMD Millipore does in this space, why it's important, and why labs need to pay attention to environmental monitoring. Okay, thanks, Mark. I appreciate it. Um, so, you're absolutely right. EMD Millipore is a, a leader in the industry for air monitoring, um, and we do think it is an, an important component uh, to your environmental monitoring or HACCP plans within the food safety industry. Um, and there are regulations to support that. A um, perfect example is uh, within SQF regulations, there are guidelines about com testing compressed air and compressed gas. So, um, we have the devices that would allow you to do that. Could you talk a little bit about one or two of your devices and how it can solve a problem in a lab? Sure, absolutely. So a perfect example would be the, the RCS High Flow Touch. Um, which I can turn it this way so you can see what it says. <laughs> um, and so this is an instrument for viable air monitoring. Um, and the nice thing about this particular instrument is it, is it has an adapter. Um, and so with this adapter, now we can actually do compressed air or gas testing as well. So it's a little bit of a two for one. If you buy both units, you're able to do both viable air monitoring as well as your compressed air testing with one unit. You, you spoke about another product where it's nice to have some, some um, air monitoring solutions, but some, some libs just let the air fall on a, on a media, but you have a different solution. Yeah, we also have our MAS Eco. Um, which is an air sampler, um, and so what you were talking about is, is what we call just a settling plate. Um, so we're just letting whatever might settle from the air fall onto okay, a plate. You. And okay. so what we do is we put the plate inside here, and then we actually use a vacuum to control the amount of air that flows through. And so we get a very nice, precise, repeatable result every time we do our air sampling. 